Well, hello there. Welcome to the introduction of Group 1's Venture Proposal. To solve the problem of deficiency in basic technology understanding and a lack of holistic educational curriculum that supports it. Our software solution, TechTutor, offers educational establishments and elementary school age children access to vast libraries of self-paced tutorials by utilizing the Federal Elementary and Secondary Education Act, Part B, Sections 502 through 511, that authorizes funding grants for early learning and charter schools. These tutorials feature all of the most important applications and hardware of today and tomorrow. Our intuitive software is guaranteed to speed up the knowledge of how to use existing and emerging technologies. This gives students a head start into specific technologies and technology as a whole. TechTutor utilizes artificial intelligence, like me, which identifies the user's learning style and quickly adapts for up to 10 times faster learning. Equally important, TechTutor also offers complete and extensive training on each software and hardware technology. TechTutor's modules are compact and complete. TechTutor's target audience is children from 5 to 11 years old, with available expansion modules for older age groups. This is a very large total service available market, comprising more than 67,000 elementary schools and over 37 million elementary school students in the United States alone. The majority of school-age children are not given any formal training in how to use all the different forms of technology they must master to get ahead in life. There are some very minor and specific classes, such as how to use Microsoft Windows, or Microsoft Word, or even keyboarding classes, but obviously there will be more and more technology young children will have an advantage mastering later in life if they can avoid the traditionally steep learning curves that discourage so many children currently. The goal of our product is to speed up the ability for children to be proficient at all hardware and software technologies as they evolve at an ever-increasing rate. Once TechTutor goes to market, the software will be available both on licensed DVD-ROM and secure streaming broadband, allowing multiple options of attainment and ease of access. Before we cover how we're going to grow sales and generate leads, let us first look at the value network. In the value network model for TechTutor, there are several key points of interest and opportunities for growth. The red circles represent potential customers for our software. As you can see we have many potential customers. Blue circles represent distributors. The main distributor on this slide is Wholesale Scholastic Publishers. I will cover more potential distributors in a moment, when I speak about Alliance Partners. Now, how will we get TechTutor to market and generate leads? We will execute a three-pronged approach to the sales cycle and lead generation. First, we will generate awareness for our products by demonstrating TechTutor during press talks at strategic educational venues, key universities, and centers of formal education. Additionally we will make sure to get reviewed by prominent bloggers, newsletter writers, and journal editors of educational media for hire or as editorial. The second method of sales will be using channel and alliance partners, such as Journey Education Software, to multiply our sales reach. Some companies and organizations have long established relationships with specific schools, school districts, and organizations like the Department of Education. We will utilize partnerships and alliance partners to take full advantage of these long established relationships. Third, we will use traditional marketing and the good old fashioned sales tactics such as cold calling and appointment setting. It also makes sense to start locally. We will focus our initial selling and marketing activity on schools and school districts that are closest to the location where our national headquarters is geographically. This will help us to gain traction and have examples of past options, success and referrals setting the stage for inevitable growth. Through extensive research, strategic planning, and continuous hard work tech tutor is poised for exponential growth and a profitable future.
As TechTutor continues to advance towards our product release, the critical core processes that we must execute will first start with the main core objective, which is finishing development of a complete and exceptional product that teaches children how to effectively use different types of technology. TechTutor will work to become the best in this space as fast as possible and then become the dominant leader. In order to do this, we must have lean, smart, and fast product development. We will make iterative improvements on the alpha releases, beta releases, and the first official release. Then we will continue to make improvements, even after the official release is offered and sold. This dedication to constant improvement will make our brand stand out as the best product in the market. The second critical task is protecting our intellectual property by these methods. We'll use trademark protection to protect our brand name, logo, packaging, and colors. We'll use copyright protection to protect all our original works and processes that we develop. We'll use patent protection for all technologies we develop that are deemed new, unique, and useful by the PTO. And lastly, we'll employ two. 156-bit encryption with floating-point tracking on all software that is distributed by means of DVD-ROM or streaming over the web. Now let's take a look at our value network model. As you can see, our staff will handle most parts of the value network, especially at the beginning. Here's an overview of our core team and their pertinent strengths for this product. Josh Hauser has the experience and strengths in sales marketing, graphic design, programming, and corporate training. David Greenwood has experience and strengths in digital content production, 3D animation, educational technology development, and state-of-the-art consumer electronics. Roland Lumula has experience and strengths in IT operations, NOC operations, data analytics, extensive programming, and financial training. Christopher Bill has strengths and experience in his extensive IT background, sales and marketing, programming, and finance and law experience. So let's take a look at the major players in our board of directors and advisors. Michael Moe will be the director representing our venture capital firm. His over 20 years experience ranges from CO founding Next Advisors and GSV Asset Management to being CEO of Global Silicon Valley and advising many educational tech firms. Greg Dumont will be our industry financial strategist on the board. He has Fortune 500 experience as Vice President of Corporate Development and Operations for Houghton Mifflin Harcourt Publishing and was Vice President, Finance and Audit. Mergers and Acquisitions for Vivendi Universal, to name a few. Peter Jovanovich is our desired industry business development specialist, who is more than qualified by being the retired CEO of Pearson Education, one of the largest publishers of educational material in the world. He was also the chairman of the American Association of Publishers. As we have yet to find a suitable person to fill out the operations management role on our board, we are currently headhunting someone with at least 10 years experience with a Fortune 500 company and at least a master's degree in tech systems management, specializing in education technologies, from a school like Stony Brook. Ensuring wise growth and exponential return on investment will require continued acquisition of top-tier talent like this for creating a world-class company. TechTutor will accept nothing less than to always strive for the best talent in the industry. Because of our attention to detail, the best customer service in the industry, great products, great people, including our core team, our board of advisors and directors. TechTutor has the pieces in place for long-term sustainability and high-value creation for all the major players in our value network like parents, schools, educational publishing wholesalers the Department of Education, and other governmental units concerned with the education of our children. As technology continually changes and advances, the need to be proficient in the mastery of new technology is becoming more and more necessary. In our public school systems, students are not formally learning the basics of using a keyboard or a computer until in middle school. In addition, 
No curriculum is currently in place that educates children about operating any other type of technology. Research shows that students who become more proficient in these areas earlier have a marked advantage over their peers who do not. Familiarity with technology enables individuals to take full advantage of the tools and resources available today and tomorrow. Tech Tutor will be there to give our children the technological advantage they will need and the returns on investment our stockholders expect going into the future. Thank you very much for your attention. Have a great day.